I believe what makes a successful barber is the, like I say, it's that education. Okay, so how did I elevate myself from from just being the regular little barber that I was to to the point where I'm at now? Okay, it was all through education. Without that education, I, I don't believe that I would be as successful as I am today. And so how do you elevate yourself? Well, you seek it, you look for it. You, you, Try to find those people that are good in their in their field, and you, and you take lessons from them, and 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 you become better. You become stronger with the education. Without that education, you'll never become that strong. And then once you've got that education, then it's the confidence that you have to have when you're doing performing those services. And with with that, then it makes you a better successful partner. I mean, yes, let's say you give a great haircut. You can give a good haircut. But what about the rest of the services that entail in the barbering trade? Okay, so there's many aspects of it. So if you're like you were just talking about, you give facials. Well, I'm able to give facials because I know how to give them. Well, that's part of my services. So I'm able to, to make that type of money off of that particular service because I'm able to do it. If someone comes into the shop, and says, well, I like a, I'd like a, a facial, and I'm not able to give that facial. Well, then what did you just do? You just threw that money out the door because you're not able to do the service. So it's the education that goes behind the barber. Get that education. I don't care if you want to be a really successful barber, then you need that education. And you seek it in every way you can.